Greetings everyone. Um, today I'm in a video making mood so I did one on Ustream. Uh, I did another one on YouTube and now this is my third one and my last one for the day. The one I did on Ustream uh, was about a go bag. Now that can mean different things to different people but a go bag is really for emergency situations. Maybe well like in our house we have a um, a bench at the at the door has lids you lift it up and that's where the go bags are so we as a family bought three go bags uh, each go bag has in it enough supplies for two people for three days 72 hours and what's in the go bag well let's get started here's your backpack it's lightweight, you know, it'll last a little while, but it, you don't need much more than this. It, it is an emergency situation, right? Okay, there are two packs uh, for your food here, emergency food rations. It says on the back here that it is, uh, or where was that? Or maybe it's on the front. Yes, five year shelf life, life excuse me, um, exceeds US Coast Guard standards. So that's good. Two of those but this right here is supposed to last you I don't know why there's so much light um, supposed to last you 72 hours now um, of course this needs no introduction so you get a roll of that for two people uh, you get two dusk masks you also get two of these little sticky things uh, not sticky things but light sticks Safety glow stick, uh, six inches there. 12 hour glow, that's good. That could help you out in an emergency situations. This is one of my favorite items. The ready light, you know, the crank, crank it with your hand type deal. Um, that'll save your life. These are pretty cool. Uh, we also have something that'll help you survive. Could scare off an animal as well as alert people to where you are. And that is a survival whistle. This one has a lanyard for putting it around your neck. We also have the first aid kit. And I'm going to have a little bit of a larger one than this put in my kit. Something else I thought about that's not in this kit is a uh, crank radio. As um, Yes, a crank radio. That would be very good. Um, let's see what we have here. Um, okay, we've got emergency ponchos. And and two emergency survival blankets. Now you get so a pack of moist wipes that can be very helpful uh, helping keep you sanitary. You have also duct tape and who doesn't need duct tape especially if you live in Tennessee. Um, and then the waterproof matches that's very cool. You're going to need to stay warm especially if the emergency comes uh, during the winter time. This is your drinking water. Now, there are 12 packs, so that's six packs per person for the three days. This has, uh, okay, it says use two each, 4.225 ounce bags per person per day. So that's the amount of water you get. Um, two of these. Per day so maybe one in the morning one in the afternoon uh, they also make of course you know little kits that you can uh, f filtrate your own water that might be something you might want to might want to think about now this kit came we bought it off of Amazon from a company called survival outlet shop on Amazon marketplace each kit had uh, let's see it was sixty seven dollars and thirty seven cents um, the shipping, you know, really shot it up there. The kits are only fifty dollars each, but that's two hundred and two dollars for two families. And my wife got me one pack because uh, I'm a big guy, and she thought, well, you know, I want him to have, you know, what he needs. And then she got the other pack, the other two-person pack for my son and for herself, and the the other one, the last one for my in-laws. Who live uh, across the street from us but um, anyway that it's pretty cool I think it's worth the money 
Um, and it's, like I say, we keep it near the front door. Um, you know, um, I think that that is a good thing so that everyone knows in the family where it is and just grab it and go. Uh, you may think of some other things you would like to, you'd like to add to it. So by all means, think it over, put the go bag together, put it near the door or where everyone knows it is where you can get to, you know, an access out or egress out the door there. So hopefully this helps. And that's my two cents on the, the go bags. Uh, my name's Alan, and you can send me an email at spenceaa at gmail.com. Have a great day.